asset maintenance reliability is fundamentally around maintenance. We start with maintenance strategy review, which then helps you decide which type of strategy to approach each component. So we recommend a varied approach to maintenance to extract the maximum value. Then, once that's in place, that's where advanced condition monitoring comes in to offer you a security blanket and condition monitoring of those individual components. We were able to then challenge certain status quos that existed within our business and see where the gains were to be had. Then we were able to get into the detail of actually using the maintenance planning tool, have a complete view of the range of sites that we have within our group based on the selected maintenance strategies, actually visually see when maintenance activity was supposed to happen and what maintenance activities those were. The onboarding process was made simple by the fact that analytics could hook directly into existing systems that we had on site and use today. So, for example, it feeds directly into our plant historian, which captures ongoing running data. That was useful for historical running regimes as well as then ongoing running data. It connects directly into our granular maintenance planning systems, so we didn't have to uh, directly input all of the identifiers that label every single item of plant in our hierarchy. All of that was automated. That not only saved us time, but has meant that it's been able to seamlessly integrate into ongoing systems within our business. The most compelling benefit is that we've actually been able to, in many areas, reduce capex whilst actually increasing reliability and availability. So the predictive maintenance tools within, within the maintenance planning system have given us the confidence that the condition of many items that we would have otherwise maintained is actually good.